Prom season is almost here, and a lot of parents are more worried about their kids getting home safely than they are finding the right tuxedo or dress. Good afternoon, everybody. I'm Kevin Stanfield. Thank you for joining us here on First News at 5. Monica has the day off. Century High School sent up a powerful display today to help their students understand the impact of drunk driving. Max Grossfeld joins us now with more on that. Max? Kevin, even though it is illegal, some students still choose to party and drink alcohol after prom. But what they do when the party's over can be the difference between life and death. High schoolers don't have a reputation for always making good decisions. But one bad decision can be the difference between life and death. Students Against Destructive Decisions at Century High School wanted to make that clear. The Deutscher family, a pregnant mother, a father, and their daughter, was traveling in this car from Jamestown to Bismarck for a family reunion, but they never made it. They collided with a drunk driver who was going the wrong way on the interstate, both cars going about 70 miles per hour. Everyone involved died. It's a lot of sadness. It's disturbing, actually, that someone can be make reckless decisions and be as careless as they are and take lives the way that they did. It's sad because they had a daughter and an unborn child and to not like see them grow up or even like for you to die at a young age is really sad. Bismarck police are also making sure kids understand the importance of driving sober, answering any questions the students had. It's a valuable learning experience when you bring something like this here to show the kids that, you know, if you do make a bad decision, your life could be over in a matter of seconds. As of March 27th, Highway Patrol says there are four confirmed deaths because of drunk driving this year in North Dakota. But that number may be significantly higher based on the results of pending toxicology reports. If you'd like to learn more about the Deutscher family's story or request the display, you can go to deadlycrash.org. Kevin? All right, thank you very much, Max.